Hi Julie, I'm going to bring the banner that you sent me into GIMP and make three crops. And Right, what we've we got here now, I'm going to make it a bit bigger, obviously, <clears throat> so I can see it. And what I'm going to do is, uh, okay, um, crop, where are you? I'm going to cancel. I'm going to crop down to here. And I'm happy with that. I'm now going to save this. Okay, I'm now going to come out of that, close, and open the same one again, make it 100, and this time I'm going to crop from here down to there. Save this. What do you need to? And the third one. On this bit here, I'm going to crop. Right, so we've done the GIMP bit, and get rid of it. I'm going to pause, you don't want to see me doing all this. Right, we're now in Inkscape, and my usual document properties. I don't want that. And I'm going to draw a rectangle. Don't worry about the colour at the moment, we'll put that in. But I am going to put the width at a thousand. And the height 125. With it being in um, get Inkscape and saving as SVG, you'll be able to resize it and there won't be a problem. It does look a bit thin and small, but it doesn't matter. But we're going to make it bigger that way. It's still the same size because you can, once we select it, you can see it's 1000 and whatever. Right, we're now going to bring in the three images. So import desktop current project work in progress Julie 1 OK embed file Import Julie two file import Julie three. So we've got these three. And what I want to do now is change this blue to this green. And the best way to do that is to select it, go to the dropper and click on that green and it will bring it in, it's the same green as that. Now what we've got to do is resize this, so I'm holding for the moment control. But I think I might have to just I might, um, what I think I might do is stretch it a little bit, but not too much, or else, it, as you say, it looks funny. I'm going to bring the next one in and resize that. Bring it down, bring that down 
into there. And I'm going to bring this one in. And bring it down to there. Hmm. And up to there. I think we need to make it a bit bigger because I don't think I've got it quite on the right line. And I think I would, well, to be honest, I will leave that up to you. You may want to reduce the width of the banner, bring this in a bit, because all I'm going to do now is, let's have a look what it looks like. Play around with it. You, I mean, you may think, mm, I don't like that at all. Um, but that's how I would create the banner in Inkscape and then bring these in. Say you're having to type all that up, you could do it in there. But as I say, I've, I've just done three crops and, and brought them in there. So I'm going to save this now. Julie's banner. Um, I'm going to put it in there, didn't I? See what you think. Um, it, you know, don't worry if you don't like it. Um, but that's hopefully will give you an idea of how to create the banner. Um, as I say, if you want to make it bigger, I don't know what the size your website will take. It may need to be a bit um, wider, uh, sorry, a bit higher, uh, a bit more depth to it, and, and less there. And you can do that, you can play around with it. Hope that helps anyway, and speak to you soon. Bye.